Getting my new drawers in today. I wish you guys could feel way harder than I thought it was gonna be. starting on some chores. I think like the weekends, especially in the beginning, are always just like catch-up days where I finally get a chance to like do all the adulting things. I'm about to deep clean my stove top actually because it's been looking gross for a very long time and it, she just needs to, she just needs to get done. I don't have a ton of groceries. I just want to pick up a few things that I need restocking. Like, of course, my oat milk, which this oat milk is my favorite oat milk. I don't think I've found any other oat milk that is the same creamy texture that works really well with coffees. I'm not sure it's the healthiest because it has a ton of oil, but it tastes good. And then I got some bread because I want to make some avocado toast for Brecky. Stocked up on eggs as well, so. <laughs> I just got ready for the day feeling very good today because I did a lot of chores and got a lot of you know The adulting things out of the way as you guys saw in the previous clip I was washing my bedding and that is because I got some new bedding from Vesta who is kindly sponsoring today's video If you guys aren't familiar with Vesta, they are a home goods brand They make a lot of high quality luxurious products for your bath and home and Vesta kindly sent me two of their products The first is the super bamboo cool and smooth sheet set. The sheet set that I got comes with two pillowcases as well as one fitted sheet and then one loose sheet. I guess is what you call it. I wish you guys could feel this pillowcase right now. It literally feels so soft and comfortable. Then I also got their Super Bamboo Breathable Duvet Cover. I am someone who is trying to prioritize sleep more in 2023. Part of that starts with having high quality bedding. If you are a hot sleeper like me, where you tend to get a little warm, a little heated at night, then Vesta is for you because it has superior all season temperature control, which will allow you to sleep in a nice, cool, comfortable temperature and not be toasty all night. One thing that surprised me was that this is made out of bamboo fiber, which I thought was going to be a little bit scratchy, but it is so silky smooth. It literally feels like real silk. The other thing I love about these Vesta products are that they are sustainable, so they are eco-friendly and also certified green. They are actually 100% biodegradable, which is pretty freaking awesome and great for the planet. Vesta was also kind enough to hook you guys up with a discount code. I will leave it on the screen. I will also leave more information as well as the link to these products that I got in the description box below. Do not sleep on upgrading your bedding. Go and check out Vista. Thank you so much to Vesta for sponsoring today's video. Hello friends, it is much later in the afternoon now. I am about to head out to go meet up with Christy for some drinks and happy hour. 
very excited because I haven't seen her in a while and it'll be a nice little girls catch up getting drinks and chit chatting. Let me show you all the fit real quick though because I think she actually looked kind of cute. So we have kind of a springish outfit today because it's actually warm and sunny out. I got these like nice billowy pants from the brand Jing. I think I got this blazer from Yes Style. And then top is the Ritzia Babton. And the shoes are from New Balance. <laughs> I'm all dolled up today because I'm taking my new driver's license photo. Well, I'm getting my new driver's license today. My Michigan one expires this year. So I have to get a Washington license now that I live here. I just did my makeup. I think it actually looks very clean and pretty snatched because I contoured my face for once, which I usually don't. Hopefully this makeup will last until 20 minutes when they take my photo. Um, but yeah, hoping that it turns out semi-cute because my last driver's license photo was not cute at all. Um, not a vibe. So. I just did it! Got my driver's license photo. Basically, the lady kept telling me that my little, like, Dang. baby hairs were in the way and not registering my eyes. So, I think I'm gonna push them away. See if that ruins the look though. I also just felt like I was so stiff and like my face was probably like, you know what I mean? Just like not natural, so we'll see. I'm worried, but whatever. Let's pick a new one if it doesn't turn out well. At least it's super sunny and beautiful out. We're on our way to get some bubble tea because Mr. Matthew, Mr. Matthew, <laughs> Mr. Matthew was craving some. And we haven't had rabbit rabbit in a while, so. still living alone in Seattle. My boyfriend doesn't come back till Tuesday, it might not Sunday. I went to Pilates this morning. On the way back, I was debating whether or not to get some coffee from Monorail Coffee, but I decided not to and decided to make my coffee at home instead, so here we are. I'm actually about to go out again to meet up with my friend Kenzie. We actually took our solid core Pilates class together this morning and we're gonna get lunch slash brunch together. The weather took a 180 degree turn today and it is way cloudier and gloomy. 
gloomy than it was yesterday. So yeah, that's my plan is to get brunch with Kenzie and then come back home and probably do some editing because I have a ton of editing to do. I pretty much did all my chores and cleaning yesterday, so I can focus today on just getting some shit done because I feel like I'm pretty behind on content. Like, I feel like the last few months i've been kind of like lagging on my content at least long form content with youtube because i've been trying to post more short form content you know like reels and shorts and stuff like that so i was trying to follow a posting schedule for youtube of every other week of the long form content and then you know on the off weeks i'll just post some short form content during the week like two or three times that has been way harder than i thought it was going to be youtube videos take a very long time to edit and plan and film like way more than short form content and so anyway this is all stuff that y'all probably don't even worry about but i am going to probably head out now uh, but i'll take you guys along with me let's go get some brunch hate that i still have to wear a puffer jacket when it's technically spring but you know what it's fine your girl can use some more sun for sure and warmer weather i may or may not have overdressed it's actually kind of warm so this puffer might have been a bad idea It is a little later now and I've just been doing a little bit of reading the last few hours. I am no longer home alone. I'm no longer alone now. We have a special guest to accompany me. None other than Sherry. Sherry. We are watching Sherry yet again. My brother had a business trip. And so we have Sherry for a few days and it just perfectly overlapped with me being alone for a few days in the apartment. And so I have a little buddy <laughs> to stay at home with because I'm definitely not going out the rest of the day. It is very gloomy and I think it's about to rain. Probably gonna do a little bit of editing now and then chill for the rest of the night and watch my new drama. I started a new drama called Crash Course on Romance. I think it's really cute and funny. I usually don't like rom-coms, but I don't know, this one's just kind of funny. 